Hey, how's it going everybody? Scott here at 4K Gaming. Thanks very much for joining us. As you can see, we're doing a uh, three minute review of Peggle 2, a recent release on Xbox One, uh, available for download for £10. Um, what can I say about Peggle? It's uh, an excellent game. It's um, it's one that, that maybe might be looked over on, on Xbox One because it, it doesn't really obviously show you what the console can do. Um, however, I would advise you not to, to overlook it. It's it's a very simple game. It's probably a game that I guess nowadays you're probably more accustomed to see on uh, a mobile device, I guess. Um, but at the same time, it's an excellent game. It's got a lot of, uh, of charisma uh, and certainly uh, is, is enjoyable. I wouldn't overlook it simply because it it, it doesn't do uh, what you want your new Xbox One to do. Um, you know, it's, it does a lot of stuff very well, and uh, I would highly, highly recommend it. So the premise of Peggle is that uh, lots of pegs are on the screen, as you can see in the video. Um, there's a, a bucket scrolling along the, the bottom of the screen. Um, you have ten, ten balls to try and uh, light up all of the pegs. But the, the main aim of, aim of each level is to remove. Uh, the orange pegs from the screen by hitting them with a ball. Uh, now you have masters in this, uh, as you can see on the left hand side of the screen, uh, who have special powers uh, and there's a few other coloured pegs so uh, in, in each level you'll have uh, the orange pegs you have to get rid of, the blue pegs are just normal pegs um, but uh, the purple pegs give you a score bonus, green pegs uh, set off a special power that the masters have so in, uh, in this uh, video Berg has a special power that freezes the uh, freezes the pegs and allows them to slide across the uh, the screen. Every peg that that then comes in contact with um, releases or, or lights up that next peg. So um, it's got a quite a level of, of, of difficulty, I guess, once you get into the game. But it's certainly a, a fairly sort of nice learning curve um, and. and I think the thing I would say about it is that I say the charisma really sees it through. There's excellent sound usage. Um, the animations of the, the characters in the game are brilliant, um, and it's one of those games that you you sink time into that you probably wouldn't think you would in the first place. Um, so yes, maybe it doesn't show all of those things that the Xbox One can do, and all those things that you know you spent close to five hundred pounds on a console for, but don't overlook it because of that it is an excellent game in its own right uh, and I guarantee you that if you uh, if you invest in it you will end up playing it and you will end up playing more than you expected um, you know it's one of those games that you look at the clock through a few hours later and you're still playing it and, and you don't know where that time's gone but you just think oh just one more level um, so all in all an excellent game I give it a seven